All right, let's see. I need to be AB 1209. That's where my IME 100 class is at. That's it, Design Studio 1209. IME 100, IME 100. Professor, we found you. Good morning, class. Professor um, Streeter. Yeah, so today we're gonna do a, a quick video here and do a lab tour. Lab um, tour, lab tour. I know that uh, yes. you've already had a lecture and, and some design on doing your 3D printing of some tensile bars. So here are some that were manufactured here on the 3D printers. And oh, let's see, we have the X, the Y, and the, the Z directions. Um, I think I got these backwards maybe. X would go this way, Y, and Z would be up and down and uh, the drawing to match. I know you've all done that. Very good job on completing your, your assignment for that. Um, so let's just go around the design studio. Here are your, your tables where your teams are sitting. Um, and you're gonna do that virtually now. Uh, we have some whiteboards for each team. This has some information on it for your toy projects. And we have some Vex robotic spare parts that you'd be able to use to modify your robots once you get them built. Um, we have some tools for you to use, some tape measures, um, some different things here in the toolbox for you to use for your VEX robot. And over here, we have our VEX V5 Robotics Garage. And your team would get a robot kit it would have everything in this box with instructions and you would of course follow the directions at first and make sure you have all your parts stocked in your kits and then you could start assembly and then um, you could assign different assignments for your teams so we have a, a brain and a handheld controller and a battery and uh, one of those wireless controller devices. We have a pair of jaws and some wheels and a, and a gear and some motors. Some uh, smart cables. Very smart stuff here. And over in this corner, we have some toys that have been manufactured that were not able to be delivered to our Educare system. So this one would be um, different colored parts that go on the pegs that has different holes. Um, this is a, a puzzle of the world. We have our, our Kettering shape puzzle here. Um, didn't look like that. That was a musical instrument that wasn't able to be completed because um, we had to leave campus. Here's, some, here's another stacking toy puzzle. Um, we have a, a maze that uh, was 3D printed here. Had the CNC router wrote a pocket out for it. Um, 3D printed our uh, SUV. Um, this is CNC routered and painted. And we got a little trap door here and no parts. I'm not, parts probably didn't get completed because they had to leave. Then we have the fishing game. Oh, I'm over my limit. Don't. Shh, I don't think the DNR is here yet. I'm going to put those back. Uh oh. Pull the magnet. I guess the magnet's painted. So we can go fishing because the governor's allowed us to get our motor boats out. So, um, yeah. We have a musical instrument. Oh, look at this. Here's the boat we can go fishing on. Oh, this is very nice. This is all painted up. We have our 
comes in a puzzle also. And look at there, it's Kettering built. Pretty exciting stuff. Toy boat, Mr. Richardson's favorite project was a toy boat. And we have some more, some more puzzles here. We have a, a rocket ship. Um, I'm not sure if that's supposed to come apart or not. That part's all painted up. We have another puzzle here with the box with instructions to make different shapes. We have the bird, the boat, snail, flower, and then we have our, our garden cart. These were manufactured in winter term. So it's, it's really disappointing for us not to be able to work with you in the lab, but uh, hopefully we can give you a little taste of what um, happened in the design studio. And if we come through here, we'll get access into the manufacturing lab. Should we uh, cut it? Yep. Yeah.